Uh, good, uh, good evening, everyone. Queen Poetry 73 here. I just thought I'd jump on here real quick and give you a word of wisdom. Um, I am reminded, yes, of um, some things that, you know, that I had before that had been taken that I thought, you know, um, that I had it sealed or that it was mine or whatever the case was. And it slowly seemed to be either taken away or didn't reach my hand or whatever the case was. But I am reminded that um, God will restore. Joel chapter 2 verse 25 tells us that God will restore he will restore what the locusts and the canker worm have eaten. And if you know that something is yours, you know by beyond the shadow of a doubt that it is yours, God will restore the years. God will restore whatever you felt that was yours that you've lost. God will restore it. Go and get it. Get back in the presence of God and ask him to restore the years. It could be something that you valued and you felt that you lost. God will restore it. God will replenish just like your health. God will restore you. God will replenish you. Just like he will replenish the earth. Okay. So if you felt that something. Has been taken from you. Or that. You had it, it, it. It was right there in your grasp. But. You just couldn't seem to. Just hold on to it. Or whatever the case was. I'm not sure. All I know is that God will restore. Continue to hold on to your blessings. Continue to keep things before him. Continue to remind him. God says you ought to remind him of his word. God has to restore. He can't lie. He said it in his word. I will restore the years. It could be it could be the years that you've lost in a, a, a bad relationship. It could be... Um, time that um, you've lost away from um, your job. It could be times that you've lost away from doing the things that you love doing. I love writing. I love reading. I love reciting poetry. But God said that he will restore the years that the canker worm has stolen. God will restore it. He'll give it back. God's job is to deliver. Our job is to believe and to trust him that he will do what he said he will do. He's a God. He cannot lie. He said, I change if not. I'm the same today, yesterday, and forevermore. He changed if not. So in that, with that being said, because that's true, that is so, he will restore the years of the canker worm. So I am Queen Poetry 73. My charge and challenge to you today is to go back and look back at what you had, what you what you desired. God says he'll give you the desires of your heart if you delight yourself in him. You got to delight yourself in him first. That's the first part of that verse. Delighting yourself in him. Then he will give you the desires of your heart. But God said he'll restore the years from the locust, the canker worm. He'll restore the years and I'm reminded of it. And I stand on his word and he'll stand behind it. God will restore Whatever it is, go back and get in the presence of God and ask him for what it is that you desire. That is my charge and challenge to you today. Go back and ask God what it was. Bring it. And he'll, it'll come to pass. And you'll see it. It'll be right before your eyes. So, guys, I just wanted to jump on here and just get that out of my spirit real quick. I'm a little tired. I had a long weekend, but God, God will restore the years. He'll restore it. 
he'll give it back. Okay? Trust him. Read the book of Job, who lost everything, but God gave him back double. God will restore. And I stand on it, and I trust his word. So I love you as always. Be uplifted, be empowered, be encouraged, be inspired. Most of all, self-love. Why? Because he loved you first. I am Queen Poetry 73, and this is my charge today on the canker worm. God will restore. Go back and get in his presence. Spend time with him. Get right relationship with him. He'll restore. As always, guys, I love you. And until next time, peace and I'm out. Bye.